Tonight, IMPD hosted the first of six community meetings wanting to hear from people about officers wearing body cameras. Yeah, tonight, our own Emily Lonnecker was there as people voiced their huge concerns about that program. We are here to listen to you. So that's what IMPD did Monday night, to gather input on the use of body cameras by police. The department is hoping to run a pilot program over two months. During that time, they plan to test cameras from three different vendors. Officers and citizens alike like to know uh, that the interactions that they're having with each other are being accurately and correctly depicted. Civil rights attorney Brooke Smith thinks body cameras are a good idea, but wanted to see it spelled out more clearly when it was okay for an officer to turn the camera off. The policy looks like it's headed in the right direction with respect to making sure that's narrowly defined. After reviewing best practices of more than 70 police agencies and other organizations like the ACLU, IMPD has decided the body cameras will be turned on with every run and encounter, but in some cases will be able to be turned off. Because of sensitivity, because of compassion, uh, that the officer will have that discretion at the request of the victim. Other concerns were brought up as well, like who would have access to the videos. Data privacy and is a is a huge concern um, and how they're going to protect that data. Similar programs to what IMPD is considering are already in place across the country. I by no means think it is going to lead to different outcomes in terms of citizen safety, but I think it's a good start. It shows that IMPD is at least listening to some sort of national um, opinion. I'm hoping that maybe if anything does come out of this that the officers will improve their um, police interactions with the community um, and they will um, do their jobs appropriately and not um, harm citizens. But if that does happen, uh, hopefully these cameras will lead to um, some type of justice. IMPD hopes body cameras will benefit everyone. And will it improve officer behavior? I would hope so. Will it improve citizen behavior if they know we're recording? I would hope so. The hope is to start the pilot by the end of March. Emily Longnecker, Channel 13, Eyewitness News.